Today was marked down as the day the world would end, according to one interpretation of an ancient text. While most people saw it as just a bit of fun, some took things to extremes, as Noni Edwards reports. Mexico is the center of the world right now, or the supposed end of the world, to be more precise. Visitors from Europe, South America and Asia travel to Chichen Itza's Temple of the Serpent God, and why? because the ancient Mayan calendar marks the end of a 5,126-year-old cycle today, December 21st, 2012. Archaeologists have found that Mayan civilization, they had a very unique calendar with three cycles. One of them was the big cycle, was thousands of the years old. And then inside the cycle, they found that it's ending dramatically on 21st, December 2000. 12. He says it's a situation where humanity's natural curiosity and need to find led people to the wrong answers. That people are looking for messages and connections in unrelated events. Just like random things from here and there put together to give you a picture of the doom doomsday and prediction of it. We are water. Our bodies are over 75% and the earth is covered in over 75% water. So um, my understanding of what's happening at this time with the planetary alignment is uh, the it's a frequency type of thing I mean, what we are having today is to educate people that this thing is not true it's just a kind of hocus pocus December 21st also marks an alignment of the earth the Sun and the center of the Milky Way in an event which takes place only once every 26,000 years Meanwhile, in Russia, President Vladimir Putin has weighed in with his own prediction, outbidding the Mayans with an estimate that the world will end in 4.5 billion years. In Taiwan, hundreds gathered in front of a replica Mayan temple at the Museum of Natural Science in the city of Taichung. They counted down to the time of midnight in Mexico with squeals of delight from the crowd marking, well, that nothing had happened. Nearby in China, officials took the situation a lot more seriously, launching a nationwide crackdown on the spreading of doomsday rumours. Here, police in Yunnan province are burning flyers they say were being handed out to promote a cult. But not everyone was swallowing the story whole. Some took it with a grain of salt. I think it's just kind of symbolic and, uh, and that's why I want to be here. I don't expect anything really. It's just that there's going to be a gathering of hundreds of thousands of people. And then others just slept through the whole thing. Noni Edwards, Emirates News.